It is Thursday, it is 9am, and we have the first Div Driver Rewards of FIFA 22. For cheap, fast, and reliable foot coins, check out u7buy.com. There is a link in the description, and use the code HABER to get yourself a discount on all of your orders. Now, me being the no-lifer that I am, I have got myself into Division 5 um, in one night. Uh, so I have uh, the choice of... Well, I'm going to pick uh, the last set. We get a 50k pack and a Rare Election Players pack for uh getting uh rank three in division five which i think is pretty cool do i get the other set of rewards as well or do you... oh is it only the seven has wow rival rewards really have been nerfed haven't they? they they really have been nerfed um i thought you got both this and then the upgraded ones but apparently not Wow, these have been really nerfed. Um, okay, well, let's go and open up our Div Rival Awards. Before I do that, I just want to quickly play this one clip. I, I haven't put it in the title or anything like that. I just want to quickly show you this one clip on him. How, how a big plays like Haaland. Sick. I'm not even kidding. Very good. Very good. Walker! Messi! I just put Messi! What? Oh my god! What? What? <laughs> Uh, let's just put Messi, boys. Yeah, I had to show you that I packed Messi. I just had to flex it. I'm sorry. All right, so we've got ourselves um, a rare place pack and a, a rare election place pack. We'll open the rare election first. This is tradable as well. So if we get a walkout or something good, it is tradable. It's a board. English, left wing. It's not Rashford like I thought it was for a second. Jack Grealish, though. That ain't bad. We'll take that. That's not bad. That ain't bad at all. Oh, and ZH. 284s in one pack. ZH is... Not worth a whole lot. I'm going to store him in the club. We have some silvers that I don't think sell for anything. But no, Jack Grealish is not bad to be fair. I think he'll go for a little bit more as well. Uh, Bamba, two. He's about 3k. Not bad, not bad. You're probably thinking, wow, 3k, this guy's got a million coins. Every thousand coins matters, all right? Now we've got a rare players pack. Now these actually have uh, all rares. One guaranteed 83 plus, which I didn't realize before. So it's guaranteed to be at least a board. Can we get a walkout, EA? Can we please get a walkout? Please? Please be a walkout. Please be a walkout. No walkouts aboard. It's going to be German right mid. Sane. No. Nabri. Be Sane. At least Sane. I mean, I guess actually it's untradeable. So it doesn't really matter. Because I'm not selling these guards on. Um, Serge Nabri. 85 rated. They could be danglers. Joe Gomez dangler would be nice. Alfonso Davies dangler would be nice. Ferland Mendy dangler would be nice. Theo Hernandez dangler would be nice. Uh, I can't think of anyone else. They're also expensive. Anyone expensive dangler would be nice. Oh, Lucas Moore is not bad. That's a good dangler, actually. Um, so, Nabry is probably worth nothing, right? About 6k. That's not too bad, actually. Lucas Moore, a dangler. He's actually a little bit as well. And I've got him duplicate tradable. So, he'll go up to the transfer list. I don't think any of these guys sell for anything. So, we'll go ahead and discard the rest of them. We'll take that. I mean, if I was winning an RTG, those rewards would actually be really good. I'd be very happy with them. So, I'll take it. All right. I've gone and built five uh, god upgrades, and then I'm going to show you guys what I got in my uh, hybrid league and nation advanced SBC packs as well um, after these. So I just thought we'd open some of these and see if we get something decent because I've been popping like three or four at a time at random times. And I'm not kidding, like the god upgrades this year seem really cracked. I've seen some amazing god upgrades. And I've been getting some really good walkouts myself. Obviously, you guys saw Bruno in yesterday's video. Um, we've got a board here. It's going to be Ivorian Kessie. See what I mean? These are really good. They just give out sick players. I mean, Kessie, I've got a tradable version. I can sell him on. Um, what is Kessie worth? Kessie is worth about 30,000 coins. Just like that. I'm telling you, man. Very good. Very, very good. Just from a just from a 11 non-rare flipping gold upgrade. You take those. You absolutely take those. And also, I'd say be on the lookout for the likes of... Joe Gomez is and Alfonso Davies and Martial's and things like that because they're also not even boards and they are absolutely fantastic to get because they're expensive. And to get them in the team, they're really good players. So, got to keep a lookout for those. Uh, next goal is we another board again. It's going to be Quartes. Not really too fussed about Quartes, to be honest. Not really too fussed. Oh, Nuno Mench. Nuno Mench. Does he sell for anything? Nuno Mendes? Eh, he's about 1.5k. I'm not sure I'm too bothered about it. I'll I'll, I'll, I'll take the 1.1k for him. Quartas, I don't think sells for anything, does he? No, he doesn't. So, yeah. Discard that. And then the last one of the five. Can we end it with a walkout? Yeah, please. He's a walkout. Yes! Oh, it's Inform Jekko. I'll take that. I'll happily take that. Solid. 85 rated Inform. 
right now he's probably got a value of about 11k right not great however in a week two three four five weeks time if we get an spc that requires an inform and a decent rated team i'm laughing because i've got an untradeable jacko that i'm never going to use put him into an spc it's great fodder i'll happily take that that's class bit early to be getting fodder but you take that i couldn't you in there as well i actually have a tradable jacko does he sell for anything at all no but like i said good good fodder so we'll take that all right here is my uh Advanced SBC packs. All right, hybrid leagues completed. For doing so, we got ourselves a rare mega pack. Now, I don't know the exact cost of this, to be honest. I had the plays in the club, luckily. Uh, it wasn't a huge amount of, uh, of coins. It was maybe 40k, I reckon, for the whole thing. And in doing so, you get a Prime Mix players pack, a Prime Electrum players pack, a rare mega, a mega, and a rare players pack. Let's see if it was worth it. Let's see if it was worth all the players. I wonder if we're going to get a walkout in one of these packs. I hope we do. We do get a board. Go on. It's going to be Cramerich. Don't think Cramerich is selling for a whole lot. Is he? No. Don't think so. Um, oh, who are you? This is this right here. Danny Aarons will love this guy. I don't even know who this guy is, but Danny Aarons is going to love him. Four-star skills as well. Oh, yeah. Danny Aarons is going to absolutely love this guy. Two boards in the first pack, though. It's actually good. That's actually real good. So we'll take that. Two boards in the first pack. We'll discard Davis. Nice. Good start. Good start. Um, and that was in a, like a rare mixed players pack, I think. So that's a really good start. Um, in the prime election, we've got ourselves Kevin Campbell. Mm, not ideal. Not ideal. Um, I wonder if any silvers are going to sell for anything. I don't think any of those are going to sell for anything. Kevin Campbell is going to sell for about 800 coins. Politano, about the same. Just going to discard them, I think. Callahan might sell, actually, because he might be... Oh, no. Okay, never mind. Yeah, none of these guys are selling. Brilliant. Let's go ahead and discard those. They sell for nothing. Um, all right, what, what else we got ourselves? We got ourselves a mega pack, a rare mega pack, and a rare players pack. We'll go with the mega pack first. I'm hoping we get a walk out of one of these packs. What are we saying? That is a, that is a board. Ah, it's going to be Zapata. I was hoping that might have been Quadrado. It's going to be Zapata. This card doesn't look awful this year, but again, it's just not a card I'm interested in. Any expensive consumables here? No, not really. Store that in the club. Uh, Callum Wilson might sell for a little bit. Nope. What about Pipu? Does he sell? All right, people selling for a little bit, so he can go on the transfer list. The Pato, are you selling for a little bit, buddy? He's not going to sell for yeah, he's not going to sell for discard, is he? Yikes! All right, well, I don't think anything else sells there, so I'll go ahead and discard the rest of that. All right, not not bad, not great, no walkout just yet. All right, let's go with the rare mega pack next. Can we get a walkout, EA? Please give us a walkout. No, it's a board. It's going to be Summer eighty five. How did he get a downgrade? Genuinely. How? He was sick in the Euros. I guess it's not just the Euros, is it? 85, though. We'll take that. Not too bad. Not too bad. What else we got in there? Longley might sell for a little bit, I guess. Yeah, maybe like 2k for Longley. Not bad. Vertonghen, is he selling for a little bit? No. About 700 coins. Arnold, no. Baku, no. Should are we? About 700 coins. Ake might sell for a bit. And Verissimo might sell for a bit as well, actually. Is Verissimo going for anything? Wow, he's expensive. Okay, not bad. They're decent. All right, rare players pack now. The final pack, the most uh, anticipated pack, I feel like, out of all of them. Um, it's not the most expensive pack, actually. The rare mega pack's worth more, but I feel like this is the one people want to see. Will we get a walkout, EA? Please give us a walkout in this pack. Walkout in form? Oh, it's Bono. I'll take it. It is a, it is a walkout. It, it was a walkout. A walkout in form Bono. He's worth probably about 10 to 12k. It's not bad. Coins are coins at the end of the day. It's not bad at all, to be fair. It's not bad at all. I wonder if there's anything else in this pack. There could be a little walkout hiding behind it as well. Could be... There is not, but Maduka there as well, who is a little bit. But the one I'm interested in, Bufferini, is extinct at 10k. That is a 10k extinct player, so I'll send him up. 10k extinct, that is class. Bono is about 10k. So 20k in that pack, roughly. Anti Fatty, is he selling for a little bit? Probably about 2k, I reckon. Maybe, something like that. 2k-ish. Um, it's alright. It's okay. Uh, it's alright. I think, all in all, probably made a bit of profit, I reckon. Not huge amounts, but a little bit of profit. But that's what I got in Hybrid Leagues. Alright, we've just finished Hybrid Nations. The, uh, the, the full advanced SBC. Now, in return for completing the SBC, it probably cost me around... 
I'd say 30, 40k. Uh, I had the players in the club though, thankfully. We get a gold players pack, a primary gold players pack, a rare players pack, a rare mega pack, and an Electrum players pack. Let's see if we get something decent from Hybrid Nations. It was okay. Um, I think we probably made a bit of profit, but luckily we got one walkout, which was Inform Bono. And we got a couple of uh, boards as well. It's interesting that the rare silver pops up before the non-rare golds. That is very intriguing. Now, I'm not too fussed about any of these non-rares. I'm going to discard them. Uh, I'm hopefully looking to, to make profit, but I'm not on an RTG account. So, you know, it's not a big deal if I don't make a ton of coins, right? So I'm not trying to scrimp for every small coin we could possibly get. Because, like I said, it's not an RTG. If we if we make a bit of a loss because we didn't sell a couple of non-rares, it's not the end of the world. Uh, we'll discard all those. Um, yeah, so far, no board. All right, we've got ourselves a prime gold players pack next. Let's see if we get something good from this. I saw Run the Foot Market get Neymar out of one of these. It is a board. It is going to be Zapata again. We got him in hybrid leagues as well. Or well, no, hybrid nations. Whichever one we did before that. Um, we got Zapata in there as well. Fred is a good pull. Fred is very good. Fred's going to go for at least 10k. That is very nice. Tapsoba isn't really selling for much. Is Rice selling for much? No, not really. Um, these guys really aren't going for anything there. So I'll discard them. But Fred's a good pull. Fred's decent. Fred's not bad at all. All right, we've got a rare mega pack next. Can we get a walkout, EA, please? Can we get a walkout? No, we cannot, sadly. It's going to be Brazil, CDM, Fernando. Meh. It's okay. I mean, any good consumables? Shadow and a Catalyst. Are these selling for much? Is that really extinct? Wow. Okay, well, 5k there. Oh, no, they're just bugged. Never mind. I think consumables are just bugged. Yeah, consumables are just bugged. Never mind. Um, 284 is an 83. Shame they don't really sell for much. Inaki Williams goes for a little bit. That's not bad. Delafeu you might sell for a little bit. Yeah, you might get 1.5k for Delafeu. I'm going to deal with these guys and I'll be back for the last pack. All right, so we've probably made about 20k back so far, I'd say, if we're being generous. With Inaki Williams, Fred, and then the rest when the discard's probably about 25k, actually. Last pack's a 50k pack. It's just a board. It's going to be Ben Yedder, though. Not bad. That's actually good. All right, we've probably made profit now. Ben Yedder's about 20-odd k. So we're probably about 45k made back from that. Yeah, I'd say we've made I say we've made a bit of profit, to be honest. Because Ben Yedder is... Wait, well, he's actually about 30,000 coins. Oh, nice. Yeah, we've made about 50k here. So we've probably made about 10k profit, roughly. I'll take that. That's solid. That is really, really good. I I'm happy with that. That is, uh, that is a good return. That is a very good return. Yeah, overall, I would say... Um, I'm going to have to discard them because I have no chance for this space. But if I was winning an RTG... I uh, probably would have come across, come around 15, maybe 20k profit if I sold absolutely everything there. So, that's decent. I'm happy with that. Okay, gone and done League and Nation Hybrid now. Let's see if League and Nation Hybrid is better than, uh, oh my god, with Pat Ronaldo. Oh my god, with Pat Ronaldo in the Foot 22 Team of the Week kit. Uh, let's see if it's better than, um, than League Hybrid or Nation Hybrid. I think it cost me a bit more. This one cost me about 50k to complete, I think, in terms of players. We get a premium gold players pack, a mega pack, a rare mega pack, and a rare mix players pack. And I think we already made 12k back as well. So we're trying to make about 38 to 40,000 coins back, basically. That's what we're trying to do. We have ourselves a little bit of Danny Olmo. Ooh, that's actually a good pack. In terms of making coins, this pack's decent. Don't think Danny Olmo sells for anything, does he? He's got five star skills, no four. Don't think Danny Olmo sells, but I know Bellingham sells. We got about 3k, 3k ish back from Bellingham. And then does Bacambu sell? Not really, no. Okay, we got about 3k back from Bellingham. That's a good start. Ah, this Medina card also sells for a little bit as well. So, uh, yeah, overall, we've done all right. I need to actually clear out a bit of transfer list space as well. But, yeah, decent first pack. All right, we've cleared up a bit of transfer list space now. Uh, we've got a premium gold place pack, a mega pack, and a rare mega pack. Let's do these packs and see what we get. Premium gold place pack is not a board. Nah, I was hoping it'd be something decent. I mean, it could be a Laquat in there. It could be a St. Just in there still. Um, I'd say like an Alfonso Davies or Joe Gomez or something would be nice. Yeah, nothing. I mean, Buendia probably sells for a little bit for the for the SBCs, but that's about it, unfortunately. So we'll go ahead and discard that. Uh, we got ourselves a mega pack now. Let's even get something decent. Can we get a walkout, EA? Please. Rewarders. Board. We got a board. Hey, Mertens is really good, actually. That's a good pull. 84 rated. That's decent. He's coins. He will sell. 75 to 80 rate player pick. LaCroix, 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 LaCroix. Martinez. Hey, I'll happily take... Oh, and Fred. Hey, that's a big pack right there. That is a good pack right there. So Mertens probably about 8k. Fred's about 10. Lehman might sell for a bit as well. 
Lehman's probably a couple of thousand coins there as well. Uh, not too shabby. We'll happily take that. We've done well from that pack. We've done well. All right. Last pack's a rare mega pack. And uh, we ended off with a walkout EA from the rare mega pack. 55k pack. No walkout. It's a board, though. It is going to be Jimenez, unfortunately. 83 rated Jimenez. So they, I mean, it could be an Alfonso Davies or a Joe Gomez in there. But that's probably the best we can hope for here. No. Nathan Ake is worth a little bit. Vesimo is worth a little bit as well. I think we might have made an L on this one. I don't think we would have made profit on this one. I mean, Schultz goes for a little bit. No, I think we probably made a bit of an L on this one, unfortunately. That's a bit unlucky, if you ask me. A bit unlucky indeed. 